on the mountaintop he said Lord show me your face show me your glory and 2nd Chronicles 7 14 it also said if my people who are called by my name will humble themselves and pray seek my face and turn from their wicked ways then I will hear from heaven forgive their sin and heal their land why seek my face why not seek my hand? Why not seek me? Why not seek my power? Why not seek my miracles? Why seek my face? Join us as we answer that. And first, we answer the first call of God in our lives. And that is the call for intimacy. my face not my hands not me not my power not what i can do you know the bible when it speaks about the hands of the lord it talks about his power it talks about what he can do it talks about the miracle of god it talks about the great things that god can do but if we talk about face it talks about a relationship he may be the God who is able to do great things. He may be the God who can take you out from that situation. He may be the God who is all-powerful, all-knowing. But if you don't have a relationship with Him, you will just know Him as a powerful God. But He said, no, if my people who are called by my name will humble themselves and pray, seek my face and turn from their wickedness. It is very important to seek the face of God. The face of God talks about Him personally, talks about what is in His heart. It talks about a having an intimate relationship with Him. Seeking the face of God talks about intimacy to Him. That I can talk to the Lord. In fact, the Lord Jesus came here on this earth. He died on the cross, but on the third day He rose again. And the veil, the covering, the separation that man and God has was, was being uh, turned down, was being ripped. Now we have the full access to seek God, to seek His face, to have intimacy with Him. Are you seeking intimacy with God? Are you seeking for a relationship with God? Are you praying for answers? Are you just praying for miracles? Are you just praying for healing, for provisions? Are you just praying for you to be set free from whatever is holding you right now? I am telling you, God is inviting us to go deeper. Step a little farther and seek His face. Have a relationship with Him. The Lord's Prayer started with our Father who art in heaven. And that talks much highly of relationship. That when we come before the Lord, we will not come before the Lord because He can and He will answer our prayers. We come before Him because our, He is our Heavenly Father. I am encouraging you right now, in the season of pandemic, in the season where you're in right now, 
in your circumstance where you're in right now. Seek the face of God. Seek a relationship with Him. Seek intimacy with Him. Seek Him. Not just the things that He can do, but seek Him. I am encouraging you. And when you have Him, you will have everything that you need. Seek the face of God. Can I pray for you right now? Heavenly Father, those who are watching online, those who are watching these videos right now, I pray, oh God, that there's going to be a personal encounter with your presence in the mighty name of Jesus. That Lord, in his room or in her room, wherever he or she is right now, that you will let him or her feel the power of your presence, feel the power of your love, oh God. That he or she will desire for a deeper relationship with you, for an intimacy with you. I just speak blessings into his life right now. Bless him, Lord God. Bless all the aspects of his life. Bless the works of his or her hands in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. These are short inspirational videos and I'm encouraging you if this is the first time to visit this channel, kindly click the subscribe button below and click the notification bell so that you will be notified for our up, uh, updated videos, for every videos that we upload. I am encouraging you, join us.